Hello? Hello? So it looks like we got Monscat versus Ruben. I think Ruben's going Falcon this time. So it's Falcon vs. Peach. Yep. That's the match. We just played this match. Yeah. Alright. Hey. Uh, I think normally Ruben struggles against Monskite's Peach. Like as Falcon, even. Well, I don't think he's that good in the matchup in general. Yeah, because you've beaten him a few times. Yeah. Like, I haven't played against his Falcon recently, but from what I remember, um, it's not the best. Yeah. I know McLeod does speak pretty highly of Ruben's Falcon, though. Plays it on that play a lot. Yeah. So. Well, to be fair, McLeod's Peach and my Peach are two different Peaches, so... Yeah. McLeod's, like, a lot more into, like, using, like, sub play up airs and stuff, while you would just focus more on, like, dash attacking in the situations where you would use sub play up air. Yeah. I mean, his is, you know, probably a lot yeah. better in some situations, but mine is a lot easier. Yeah, I think the style that he's going for is, um, it's going to be better when he, like, masters it and, like, gets really consistent, but yeah. right now he's not very consistent. He's going to, like, mess stuff up. Mm. So. But, you know, all you need sometimes is just a dash attack, especially when it knocks yeah. him far away, when they're near ledge. Yeah, dash attack is, like, really, really good. Yeah. Ooh, small. It's gonna be a small stage. Yeah, it's interesting, because we struck the battlefield. Yeah. I know, I like battlefield as Peach in the matchup. Oh, well, even Falcon. Yeah. Are oh, you gonna switch the cameras? Do you know how to do that? Oh. Uh, I, I guess it doesn't really matter. It's fine. So Ruben's looking pretty fast right now. Yeah. Just like doing aerials and just dashing back and so just pretty much what you have to do. Yeah. Well basically in the early percent your goal is to get percent without committing because lots of your moves are yeah. much cancelable. That's Falcon I mean. I think at oh. low percent... Oh. Up -ed. I think at low percent you really just want to go for a grab or like a stomp or something because mm. Nair just gets crouch cancelled. Yeah. Those, those are both commitments. Like grab less so because it's so fast. Yeah, dash grab is like unreactable from like a certain range. Yeah, so I guess it's just, it's getting in that range to get a dash grab. Yeah. Like that. That was pretty good. Down throw knees is kind of hard to get on the beach if you're trying to react to the DI. Um, sort of, but it should, like, it's not, it's not that hard, I'd say. But thank you, Jack. Yeah. It's because Peach has, like, really, like, she has, like, frame, like, really fast options to escape her. So yeah. you have to be really frame perfect. Yeah, but so worth it. Yeah. Yeah, see, the thing about this matchup is that both characters can combo each other a lot. Yeah, that's true. I mean, that's to be expected anything against Falcon. Yeah, Falcon against anybody, really. Yeah. Like, he has combos on everyone, but gets a bit hard himself. Yeah. He is so fun to hit. I definitely would not have done that turn sometimes. Just wait for the net. So Muscat does the same DI and gets me for it. Mm. Should probably mix up his turn. I mean, just to like make it a bit harder, I think. Like maybe Ru I don't. I doubt Ruben has like the reaction down. I don't remember he had it down perfectly. But last time I think he had it down somewhat. Oh yeah. Yeah, that happens. Side B can go through projectiles. Yeah. 
kind of stood up their place in this match, but it's... Yeah, it's, it's really hard to pull them yeah. against Malcolm. You just, like, fly across the stage, you know. It's, um... Oh, okay. Oh. Alright. See you later, stream. Hey ho, Kai's back on the mic. How's this set going? Uh, if they just took the first game. Okay. Yeah, they go on to stadium. Which what is what's your opinion about the the whole counter pick war that these two have been having? Um, oh, this I'm is best of five too, damn. Is it? Oh, it was winning semi, so. Oh yeah. Could be like that. Um, I know. I'm just surprised Ruben's going Falcon since historically this has not been a matchup he's good in. Well, you know, if he can if he can beat Anthony's Peach, then you know. Good on with him. Ooh. Just this match of um as the Falcon you need to be competent and you're Ooh. neutral and punished. Musket doesn't have a jump either. No. Uh, he's not gonna get You can't really get down this situation as Peach. Nice! Yeah. He traded with like the last hit too. That was pretty hype. Ruben's actually got tag on Falcon. It's pretty cool. Yeah. I'm actually. It's funny how we went from like having no Falcons to three. Didn't we have Mark for a while? Yeah, we did. And then he stopped playing for a bit. And then Caleb showed up around the same time Mark started playing again. Oh. Like, that was a. That was like about a year when Mark didn't really come to much. It's been a while. So it's hard to remember the early days. <laughs> the early days. Oh. Do you think this is a good stage for Ruben and Falcon? Um, I think it's a good stage for Falcon. I'm not sure about Ruben's Falcon. <gasps> oh! oh he did the thing. That was gonna be it. Don't pick it up. Don't pick it up, Ruben. But no, I want one of them to pick it up. Whoa! Okay. Okay, musket. Oh. All right, now he... uh, it's probably it's gonna be his undoing. Honestly, yeah. I don't know how. I know. I remember back in the day when uh, Ruben actually entered tournaments with Falcon when he first started? Mm -hmm. Eons ago that was. Yeah. That was like four years ago, just about. Yeah. Then you played Samus. Can he keep going Falcon? I don't. I don't like the Samus match. <laughs> well, the thing is, is like. I don't well, know. I don't. I don't, I don't even. I don't even know what like why the Falcon came to be, like, in today's world, you know? Uh, I think, like, maybe... So he's tried this fox before, right? Yeah. And I'm, like, hasn't worked out. So That's maybe, true. Maybe he was, like, going back to his old bread and butter Falcon? Maybe, yeah. Since the matchup is, um... It's not bad for Falcon. I'd say it's in his favor. Does Samus have a three-frame jump squat? I feel like she does. Someone in chat can confirm that. Also, our internet is uh, dying. We might need to swapsies to this one. You never want to have a turn up point. There we go. He's anywhere that close. This should this should come back now. Oh. That was a good feedback. I didn't go for stomp. Oh, no, stomp. Oh, that's good. It's just a disadvantage. Oh, no. The turn up. There we go. Uh, All right, we're back. Uh, we're back. We're back. Uh, I saw the I saw the red square in the corner, and I'm like, oh shit, we're not we're not online anymore because the net dropped out. No if you're still watching, thank you. Say hi and chat if you're here. And we're going back to stadium. Hey, no stadium is. A legit pick in this matchup as the Falcon. I think he just doesn't want to deal with Dreamland. Well, I mean, what stage would you pick as the Falcon? Honestly, yeah, either this or Yoshi's. Yeah. Every other. Uh, I don't think Battlefield's too bad, but like, I can't. I don't know if the side boss zones are close on this stage. Uh, I believe they are. They seem like they are, don't they? Yeah. But I haven't actually looked at 
the exact blossoms. Yeah. Because, like, if it is pretty close, then it would be the best stage for the Falcon, but... Whoa. Oh, what a sick recovery, actually. Yeah, he's been getting some good feedbacks. At the moment, Ruben's just getting stuffed out by the lingering hitboxes of a lot of Peach's moves. Like, the very last active frame kind of stuff. Because Falcon takes a little while to get out of his attacks, and yeah. Peach doesn't take that long to get out her attacks. Yeah. That's why you need to make use of Falcon's immediate speed yeah. before you put out hitboxes. Ooh, oh. bye! <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> That was pretty funny. <laughs> but you don't want to be here if you're even there. Yeah. You want to be as far away from... Yeah, okay. That's what you want to do. Yeah. You want to just stump the yard here. Oh, Using invincibility. I, I wouldn't... I don't know. I personally wouldn't go down unless you think... I wouldn't go down there unless you're invincible. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Like, maybe if you were to go to, like, yeah, a yeah, ledge yeah, yeah. and then good. drop down. You, you just want to take away the stitches. You just want to take away the turnips. That was a bomb. No bomb for musket, though. Yeah. I saw the explosion and I was like, ooh. <gasps> oh, what a ballsy grab. If Nangs was actually really early with an aerial there, he would have blown Musket the fuck up. Sometimes you gotta make those decisions. Oh, here we go. Nangs? Now Ruben's starting to get more comfortable. You can see him actually like running around. Mm. It's good. When the Falcon just takes control of this stage it is so impressive as Pete. Nice. Nice. Yeah. I like that he's willing to take these trades. I mean back is just really good. That sort of thing. Okay, I think I think uh, Ruben's starting to figure mm. one or two things out now. About the matchup. He's yeah. using the platforms? Yeah. Using the really oh. big stomp hitbox? Oh no. Yeah, that's, that's deaf. Yeah. No chain up this. Oh. Everyone has to play very carefully. He's just getting snuffed out. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, That's Ruben's not happy him. about that grab. Uh, he has to finish his stock pretty much now. Yeah. <gasps> oh, That's that. No. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're up. <laughs> we're up. 